As an internet activist, Aaron Schwartz's outspokenness ruffled more than a few feathers in Washington. The enemies of the freedom to connect have not disappeared. The fire in those politicians' eyes hasn't been put out. There are a lot of people, a lot of powerful people, who want to clamp down on the internet. But it was his alleged actions honest, that led to an all-out legal fight with the government. Schwartz was arrested in 2011, accused of stealing more than 4 million documents from MIT and JSTOR, an archive of scientific journals and academic papers. Schwartz had been facing up to 35 years in prison. His lawyer told Bloomberg West prosecutors had offered a plea deal that could have seen Schwartz spend six months or less behind bars if he pled guilty to 13 felonies. But that offer was rejected. Schwartz's family blamed MIT and prosecutors for his death which the New York Medical Examiner's Office ruled a suicide by hanging. The U.S. Attorney's Office, District of Massachusetts, declined comment. In a statement, MIT's president said the school initiated a thorough analysis of MIT's response to Schwartz's use of its computer network.